What's up, weirdos? It is time for some more Miss Survival, and today I have some fun things planned. Uh, first things first, we're going to go ahead and get the zombie corral made, because uh, I've been putting it off for way too long. So we're going to go ahead and do that, and then after that, we're going to the mine. And uh, yeah, we're probably going to encounter some zombies there, too. So the reason I have Rachel making sticks is so we can... Uh, we can make a lot of fence. We're going to need a lot of fence, too. Uh, I have a decent amount of components on me right now. I think we're probably going to need more than that. Um, another thing I'm going to need is I'm going to need another chair. So we should probably grab some wood for that. I'm going to grab enough for two chairs. Yeah, let's uh, split half and yeah, just take a bunch of nails with us, too. We're going to need that whenever we go to the mine. But uh, before that, we're going to make this corral. Uh, now the question is, how do I want to make this? Do I want to, uh, I think I want to bring this out a little bit, maybe. Yeah, I think we should probably bring this out. So that's what we're going to do. Um, I'm not sure if there's any zombies out there right now. The time is five, so we should be good. Yeah, we should be good. I hear the birds chirping, so there shouldn't be any zombies out here. I think we're okay. All right, so that's what we're going to do. We're going to extend this out a little bit. Uh, now what I'm thinking, I, I want to make it so that I can still open both sides of the doors. Um, or both doors. So, open a door over here, and then also open another door up here. So we've, we've got to build it so that we can do that. Uh, now, how do we want to do this? I think we probably want to put the corral out here. Yeah. I probably want to have that corral going out to here. So what I'm thinking is I want to build I want to build this out from here. All right. We'll build this out from right about here. Actually, we're going to put it on this side. I'm going to put it right here. Build that out from there. Okay. That looks pretty good and then I'm going to build I'm gonna get it set I'm gonna build oh uh, do you want to clip in there there we go that's what I want I want that to clip in so I can get this at the perfect right angle yeah it's got to be it's got to be 90 degrees there we go so we build that and then we're gonna build a bunch of these we're gonna let them all click in so, uh, let's see, go to the house, go to the fence. We're going to build probably down, down at least down to here. Yeah, I'm liking that. Okay, and uh, maybe a little, bit, a little bit more, maybe. We can make it fairly large, really. It, I mean, as long as it's two spaces, that's, that's all I need. Okay. Uh, now, I'm probably going to put a door over here. Probably have a door over on this side. And we'll probably have a door over here as well. So this part I want to bring over this way. Like that. Oh, wait. Okay, that's pretty close. And then we're going to build this all the way to the wall, pretty much. Yeah, it's going to go pretty much all the way to the wall. I might be able to just bring this over here. We could do that. Um, I might do that. I don't know. I haven't decided yet, guys. I haven't decided yet. I want to bring this down here. We're, we're going to destroy this right here, but until I have all this built... We're going to hold off. So I want to build something like that. And then I want to bring this fence. Yeah, in this direction over here. Make sure that's 90. Oh, that's going to be hard to tell. I think that's about 90 right there. Oh, man, it, it's so close. We're going to guess that that's... Oh, that's not, that's not 90 at all. All right, cancel that. Gonna have to build it from this side. There we go. This will give me a better idea. So, do that. There we go. Alright, I think that's actually pretty close. 
Maybe just slightly that way. Um, sure. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, wait. Okay, well, that's fine. We can, we can build that one section right there. That's fine. But we want to bring this out. To here. That doesn't look 90 to me. Oh, boy. I think I might have done something wrong here. No, it's, it's got to be right. Yeah, it's got to be right. This should match up right here with this, though. And it's not doing that for whatever reason. Is this not 90 right here? I don't know, guys. Something just looks off. Something looks way off with this. Um, we're going to go with it. <laughs> we're going to go with it. Just keep going with this and uh, yeah, put that there. Okay, and then this is going to go right over here, I, I guess. I, man, it, just, it doesn't look right. Doesn't look right at all, but I'm going to put it like that. Okay. I, I don't think this is 90 right here. I think that's where we screwed up. You know what? That's fine. I don't care. I don't care. This part right here, I'm going to just close this off. Yeah, that'll be fine. Let's see if that's clipping in. If it does clip in, it'll be over here. Really, that's it's out of the way. It doesn't matter. All right, so here's what we want to do. We want to put a door over here somewhere. I think putting a door here would be a good idea. In case we want to get out. Might be a good idea. Eh, you know what? Double door is probably a safe bet. I think if we put a door right over here, we're probably in better shape. So we're going to cancel this right here. Okay. And I'm going to build a fence door like this. It's going to go right in the middle. And make sure this matches up. The last thing we want is for it to not match up. Oh, no. That, that's not right. All right. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to build the fence, and then we're going to put it in, in once it's done. Uh, and then the other door that I want to put in is going to be right here. So we're going to cancel this. Okay. And we're going to build everything else. We're going to build a door right here, too, I think. Yeah. Yeah, we'll put a door right there. Okay. And then everything else is going to be fence. Yeah, there we go. Now we're starting to come together. Starting to come together now. I don't know if I'm going to have enough components. We're going to have, probably have to go and get some more. Take a look. Yeah, we're almost out. Let's build what we can. Okay. There we go. Oh, you know what? That That's a mistake right there. Yeah, because I'm not going to be able to reach that door from here. I'm not going to be able to reach that door. Yeah, we've got to build the door right here. All right, um, let's put that gun away. I want the sledge. Okay, and smash this up. Fortunately, we get all the parts back, so that is one nice thing about these fence doors. Okay, and then we're going to build a fence right here. All right, just like that. Try to get that lined up. Oh, it's so touchy, so touchy. There we go, perfect. Uh-oh. All right, well, this is going to get put to the test, isn't it? Ah, oh, we're not done. We're not done. Oh, boy. All right, we're going to have to sleep through the mist. It's not ready yet, guys. It's not ready. Take a little nappy nap. We're going to go two hours. Well, that should put us at the end of the mist, hopefully. Uh, no, okay. Well, let's go another hour. Oh, that's half a day already. Already gone. Plus, we still got to go to the mine. 
Man, I was not factoring in the mist today. I was not factoring in for that. Unfortunately, we just lost a lot of time. That's fine. We'll continue building. I think I'm out of uh, components. I'm almost out of components. All right, so do I want to put a door door right here? I think I want to put a door right there, so we're going to build right here. Okay, and then let's go get some more components. I probably need some more sticks, too. Let's take a look here. Oh, we're out of sticks. All right. I'm going to have Rachel or somebody make some more sticks. This is all we got left, seven. All right. That'll do for now. Sticks. Make seven sticks. Um, whoever's around, Scott, go for it, buddy. I don't know where Scott is. I haven't seen him in a while. Oh, there's Kate. Where's Scotty boy at? Scott, where are you at? Where are you at, Scott? Oh, gosh, they're stuck. All right, here's what I like to do. Whenever they get stuck, I come over here to this other garden shed that I built. And we're going to make that our active base. And then we're going to go over to the other garden shed. And bring them back over here. And they should get unstuck. Now another thing you can do whenever they're like that. And they're stuck in the doorway. And uh, just levitating. You can put something underneath them. Like a suitcase or, or something like that. And that should get them unjammed. So I know that that's happened to me before. Where I've actually been stuck inside my house. Uh, because they were stuck. And uh, I, I just, I, I did the suitcase trick and it worked out just fine. All right, so here's what we're going to do now. We're going to put in a door right in the middle. Just like that. Okay, let's take a look at that. Is that, uh, that's close. I mean, it's not perfect, but it doesn't have to be perfect. It is the apocalypse. What are we missing? Components. All right, let's go grab some. We are being drained of our stash of components. My goodness. We're going to have to go get more. Yeah, we're probably going to have to do that next video, I think. So build this door. Then there's another couple doors that i got to build. So let's open that up and take a look at that. Perfect. Okay. I want to build a door right here. So fence door. So we're going to build that... Right there. I think that lines up. I hope it lines up. I guess we're going to find out. Okay, there we go. That opens up like that. Perfect. All right, and then this is uh, just a livestock fence. We'll go ahead and build this. Okay, nice. And then we need a door right here. Rachel, she's trying to get out. She's trying to get out. You see that? You see that? She's trying to escape. All right, go back in there. All right, I want to put a door right here. So build that. Now we have a nice zombie corral, and hopefully this will bring the zombies and the bandits over to us. That's what I'm hoping. It doesn't mean it's going to work, but uh, it might. It might. Um, better close this. I don't want Scott getting out. Okay. And we want to put a fence right here, I think. Now, do we want to do a door? We could do a door right here, or we could do just a fence. Um, I kind of like the idea of having a door, but if I put that there, the zombies are going to go to this door. So let's just do fence. Yeah, we don't want the zombies coming here. We want them actually coming into the corral and coming here so I can close this off. And you know what? I'm not going to be able to close that door, am I? Oh, that was a bad decision. Um, what if I, what if I build another fence over here? Yeah, that's what we'll do. We'll build a fence right here. Kind of like that. Alright, and that's going to face down like that. Come on, come on. Just a little bit, just a little bit. Alright, perfect. We'll build that. And then we'll build another one right here. Right? Yeah. Okay, now, now, now let me show you what I'm going to do. We're going to smash this up. Get our components back and our sticks. 
Smash this up. Don't need that. Okay. Whoa, components are flipping out. All right. And um, I don't think we need this anymore. Well, th this would keep them. This would definitely keep them from going over here. So maybe, maybe we should keep this here just in case. But this allows me to close this door. Allows me to open this door and close this door. So that is good. That's what we want. Perfect. Perfect. And so whenever the zombies come in, we can just close that up, close that up, and uh, we'll trap them in there. And then I can uh, I can poke them to death. I can kill them with the sledgehammer. I can shoot them if I want. But uh, th that'll be really nice. It'll be a nice little zombie corral. So that is perfect. We're going to have to get some lighting out here for sure. Uh, but uh, we're not going to do that today. That'll be uh, a different day. Uh, for now, i got to make sure I have... Oh, man, I only have, I only have nine sticks. All right. Um, hey, you weren't you you doing this. Rachel, go make some sticks. Okay. And I'm going to go ahead and eat something. We are getting pretty hungry. So let's go ahead and have ourselves another bear steak. Uh, we'll go eat the 50%. We also need a drink. Those pops are starting to degrade pretty quick. So I'm going to go ahead and have another pop. 36.3, uh, 35.4. We'll go ahead and drink that. Perfect. The green pops here, uh, which are the white pops in the uh, the new version of the game, these do not degrade at all. So definitely uh, definitely save those. Don't drink those. Uh, those are f definitely for a rainy day. Uh, but uh, yeah, there we go. Looking pretty good. Got ourselves a nice corral. I like that. Just got to get some lighting out here, and then it'll be uh, it'll be real spiffy. Uh, but uh, for now, I think we're gonna go down to the mine once. Once Rachel's done with these sticks, I think she's done already. There we go. So we got 16 there. Um, I'm going to put some of these components back. I don't need all of them. Uh, we'll put that one in there. We'll put that one in there. We'll take 16 with us. There we go. I've got lots of nails and lots of wood if we want to make some more chairs. It's always a good idea to have lots of chairs when you go down to the mine. Okay, and uh, I might want to take some food. Let's see, this is degrading pretty quick. So let's take an apple. Let's take a couple apples. That'll be, that'll be a nice, yummy treat. And then uh, we're good on water. So let's head on down to the mine. This is where it's going to get very dangerous for us. You know what? I should probably, should probably grab my good arrows for this. I want to make sure I kill those zombies in one shot. Yeah, probably a good idea. So let's go to our equipment. We're going to add arrows. We're going to take these ones out. Okay. And I'm going to close out of that just so I don't get any glitches. Because the last thing I want is to lose my really nice arrows. Because that can happen. They can glitch into basic arrows. So I've got to be really careful with that. And we'll put these back in here. Perfect. Alrighty. Here we go. To the mine. And uh, it is getting late in the day, but I don't think we're going to be there too long. So I think we'll be alright. The big thing is I don't want to be there for like I don't I don't want to be there past uh what 8 p.m. Yeah, if we're there past 8 p.m. then we're in trouble. But I think I think we're okay if we go down there right now. We still have still have a few hours. So we'll go ahead and save and we will head on down to the new mine. We're gonna go to the new mine. The old mine is just too far away. Oh gosh, I'm always hitting these trees. I need to have Scott cut these down. They're just, they're in the way. Plus we have all these logs over here that I gotta pick up too. So maybe we'll do that next video. I got so many things planned, guys. I don't know when we're gonna get to some of this stuff. So many things I wanna get done. And I don't know how long we have until that next big update. Because once that next big update drops, I think we lose the old map for good. I think it's gone. And then we're on the, uh, the new version. Hopefully it'll be better. I'm going to reserve judgment until uh, until we see the finished product of the uh, the new update. Hey, they're shooting at me. Those stupid bandits. They're just asking for it. I might go there and kill them just for fun. Got some more bandits over here on this oil rig. Just going to drive past them. And down to the mine. Boy, it is kind of misty today, isn't it? It's kind of stayed foggy after that uh, 
that mist came in. It's just kind of just kind of been like that all day. Now I'm hoping there's no zombies in the mine right now. Sometimes they spawn in. And sometimes they don't. So I guess it's just the luck of a draw. We're going to just back up right here, get fairly close to the entrance, not too close. Yeah, that's pretty good right there. All right, turn this off. Make sure I've got everything I need. I think we're good. Yeah. Yeah, we're good. All right. So here's the dangerous part. Into the mine. I never like to save while I'm in the mine. Usually not a good idea. We'll turn on our light. We're definitely going to need it because it's going to get dark. There we go. Now. Do we have any friends in here? I don't hear anything. No growling. I think we're okay. Usually, if you come back to the mine like a day after you went to it, that's when they spawn in. But I, I think if you if you wait a while and then come back, then I, I, I think they, they just disappear. Because I haven't seen the zombies up here this season. At least I don't think I have. Maybe once, maybe once they were here. Um, now, we're definitely going to need some iron, so let's go ahead and hit this up. I think we're also going to get some zinc from it. We can definitely use that. We're going to need that for brass. Okay, there we go. It only gave us zinc. I wanted some iron. I definitely need iron. Hopefully we get some with this one. Oh yeah, there we go. That's what I want to see. Grab that. Hit this up. There's some more zinc. Okay, that's fine. I'll take the zinc. We can definitely use it. Um, can I not grab that iron right there? There we go. I think I got it all. It's so tough to tell. That light is just way, way too bright. There's some right there. Okay, there we go. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. What do we got here? That's just a barrel. Okay. Alright, um, let's come over here now. Looks like some more iron. We'll go ahead and grab that as well. Okay, nice. Grab all that. And now it's danger time. Coming into the danger zone past the berserker. I have the elevator running, I believe. So let, let's hope it works. <laughs> let's hope it works. Um, why can't I open it? There we go. All right, close that. And down. Why is it not working? Oh, the power's not on down there. Oh, that's so stupid. All right, well, here we go. We're just gonna run. Ah! Here he comes. I think he, uh, I think he punched me. Yeah, he punched me. You're, you're such an a-hole, aren't you? All right, well, we're gonna have to walk all the way down here, unfortunately. I, I don't know why that power turned off. That's really weird. All right, so all the way down and deep into the bowels of the Berserker Mind, we find ourselves the mother load of ore. Well, hopefully it's a mother load. I don't know. We're going to find out. Sometimes uh, you come down here and there's not a whole lot of ore. And sometimes you come down here and you have way too much. And uh, you, end up, uh, you end up not being able to carry all of it back. Oh, there we go. There's some saltpeter right down there. Hopefully there's some sulfur as well. Let's get our light on so we can actually see what we're doing. All right. More iron. I like seeing that. All right. Grab that. Oh, man, that's still too bright. I'm sorry, guys. I know it's dark, but it, it, this is much better than uh, that stupid light. If the developer were just, just to make it, like, more yellow... I don't think it would be as bright. 
But uh, right, right now, the light is just way too bright. Hopefully, he fixes that. I, I, I've been complaining about that for years, so I, I, I doubt he's ever going to fix it. All right, let's come over here. Nothing over here. Here, oh, some more iron. All right, uh, stamina is down right now, so I know I have a chair over here. Let's see if we can get to it. I could go ahead and eat something. We do have a little bit of hunger available. Yeah, let's just let's just sit here for 15 minutes. Let's see how we're doing on stamina now. Oh, much better. Much better. All right, let's get this going. Turn this on. And um, call the elevator. Get that down here. How are we doing on time? We're still doing okay. All right. We'll grab all this uh, salt, Peter. I really hope there's some sulfur down here. Because uh, we really need it. We only have uh, one sulfur, and that's not going to make uh, any powder for us. So we got to find some more. We may be coming back here. Yeah, we might have to come back. Unless there's some over this way. I guess we'll find out. Grab all that. Did I get that iron that was over here? I didn't. All right, there we go. Nice. Well, the good news is we did get lots of iron, so we might be able to make all those ingots that we needed from it. All right. Nice, nice. There we go. Grab all that. Check over here. More iron and copper. Oh, this was like going to the old mine. The Berserker mine, it should have lots of sulfur and saltpeter, but it just doesn't have enough. In my opinion, it should have a lot more. Especially since we, we need it to make ammo. Alright, well that's it. So, we got a little bit of saltpeter. Not much, though. Not much of the saltpeter. And we didn't get any sulfur, unfortunately. So, yeah, I don't like that. Don't like that at all. Um, I'm going to go ahead and sit for about 5 or 10 minutes. Get that stamina back up. And then we're going to head on back to the top. So let's jump in here and close that and up to level one, activate, let's go. And you will see something very magical happen. Uh, the Berserker will have turned to stone and yeah, he doesn't move. It's a bug and that will definitely uh, be fixed, I'm sure, eventually. But uh, yeah, there you go, Mr. Berserker, hey there. Hey there. Uh, 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 uh. All right. Let's get out of here. How much you want to bet there's going to be zombies? How much you want to bet the zombies will be waiting for us? Oh. Oh, hello. This always spawns back in, by the way. Every time I go down there and come back up, this is sitting here. All right. A little more zinc. Won't complain about that. Okay, here we go. Well, let's see how our luck is. Do we have friends? Nope. I think we're good. Oh, well, we're going to run out of the mine just in case. Yeah, there's nobody here. Well, that's uh that's nice. It used to be, like, there was always zombies in here. And that's why I'd always have to build, like, a fence just to keep, uh, just to keep them from attacking me. Like, I would always put, like, a fence right across here. In the new version, uh, this mine is really bugged, and the zombies can actually run through these walls. So, <laughs> putting a fence there doesn't really help. But, uh, it definitely, it definitely would help, uh, on this version... All right, we're going to throw this stuff in here. Actually, you know what? I'm just going to keep it on me. Might as well. Let's head on back to the base. And uh, we'll go ahead and 
Maybe harvest some zombies tonight. I think that's a. I think that'll be a fun way to spend the evening. All right, guys, back in the town, and I'm checking for bandits. I think we're okay, though. This is always one of my routines. I always come through here and look to see if there's any movement. Uh, you know, while we're at it, we we have the time. I think it's probably a good idea if we grab our sledgehammer. I'm gonna throw this back in here because I don't need it right now. And I'm going to hit up a few more cars, get some of those components back. Because we did use up quite a bit. And we don't have a whole lot of scrap left either, so might as well do this. There we go. Grab all this good stuff. Alright. Anything else? Any spark plugs? Sometimes you get spark plugs. We don't have a whole lot of spark plugs, so it's definitely a good idea to grab them if we can. And they are hard to see. Alright, what do we got here? We've got more components, more scraps, wooden planks. I guess we'll grab the wooden planks. Yeah, we'll grab them. Alright, I'm going to come over here now, smash up these cars. There's quite a bit over here. Might as well do it. Might as well get it done. There's no bandits, so do it whenever, uh, do it whenever you can. Because when they spawn in, they are definitely a pain. All right, there's a spark plug right there. Let's see if it's any good. 19.5, uh, I'm just going to throw that out. If it's not above 40%, I usually just get rid of it. It's really, really no sense in keeping it. Because you find, you find a decent amount. Especially if you're smashing up cars a lot like this. I've never seen an engine in these, though. I would love to find an engine. Oh, we're out of space. All right. Um, let's come over here. Let's throw something in here. Uh, do, 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 do. What do I not need right now? I don't need the zinc. All right. Let's grab all of this. I thought I saw something moving over there. That scared me for a second. We're okay. We were okay, guys. Alrighty. So, let's take a little ride back over to the natural garage. <laughs> I don't know what else to call it. It's just my place where I park my truck. It's kind of secluded back here. It's kind of protected from bandits a little bit. They can't really shoot at it. And Rachel can't get over here, fortunately. Alright, turn the light off. Turn the truck off. There we go. Alright, um, I am a little bit hungry, so I'm going to go ahead and eat one of these apples. Okay, and let's grab this stuff. And we'll just leave the spark plug in here. There we go. Beautiful. And back to the base. Now, there's also some more uh, components that we can get from this car. I don't know how much space I have. I got enough room for about four components. How about scraps? We got enough room. We got enough room. All right, smash it up. Get the good stuff. All right. Oh, there's a battery here too. I don't. I don't know if it's any good. We can't pick that up. Let's uh, let's come over here. And let's put some stuff in here. You guys, just just leave the door open. That's all you gotta do. Just leave it open. Okay. They're they're kind of dumb. They are not quite there. All right, let's go get that battery. Let's see if it's any good. I'm hoping that it's decent. Uh, forty percent. Yeah, that's that's good enough for me. We're gonna go ahead and close that up, and I want to make a couple lights. So let's do that. Smash up another car. Get this out of here. If it's here, I always smash it up. Because it is free components and scrap. I don't have to really do anything. Just smash it up. Waste a little bit of stamina. And uh, we'll throw you guys in there. Throw you in there. I didn't need the nails. I didn't make any chairs. I, I probably should have while we were down there. But uh, yeah, I didn't do that. Maybe I'll regret that. I don't know. Throw that in there. 
Okay, and then uh, the other battery. I've just been stacking them here for now. We'll have to make a, an actual locker for them. But uh, for now, they're just going there. Okay, and then all this stuff. We can put all this away. Uh, we can throw that in there. Okay. Oh, man. Oh, man. Um, yeah, let's put this in here. Let me put that down there. There we go. That's a little bit more organized. Okay, and then these will go in here. You can put that in there. And then we we'll still have a few more of these. We'll put those there. We'll put that there. And I need to cook these down. So let's go ahead and do that. Come over to the furnace, the melter machine. Go ahead and cook those. Okay, and time to make a few lights. I'm going to need at least two over here. I'm thinking, uh, where did you come from? You weren't there a minute ago. Oh, those stupid trees. I found if you log out and log back in, they usually they usually disappear. Um, I'm probably going to have to cut these down, though. Yeah, probably going to have to cut those down. Uh, but for now, let's go ahead and put some lights over here. I want a lantern post light right, uh, right about there. That seems like a pretty good spot. So we'll build one right there. And then I want another one over this way. We'll put it... Uh, I could put it right here. Yeah, you know what? We're going to put it right there. Actually, eh, yeah, yeah, we're going to put it on the corner right here. This, this will be nice. This will be a good spot for it. So there we go. We're going to need some wood. We're going to need some electronic parts and some components. So let's go ahead and grab what we can. I don't think I have any electronic parts left. I might have a couple. I think I use them all up. Fortunately, there is a way that we can get them very quickly. Um, we'll go ahead and do that. Um, let's build them out here. These things are free to build. If I can find them. At least uh, in this version of the game, the old version. It takes one hour to build one of them. So we're going to build a couple of them. As you can see, it doesn't take any materials, doesn't take any tools. We use our magical pipe wrench to build everything. So we'll build a couple of these. Okay. And then what we're going to do is smash these up. It's going to give us wood and also electronic parts. And you can only do this on the old version of the game. The current old version. It won't work in the future. But it works for us now. And we get uh, two electronic parts from each of them. So that is uh, my little secret. There we go. Well, that should be pretty good. We just need some components now. How many wood did we get there? We got four. I think, uh, I think we need another stack. So let's grab that. Okay, and then components. Perfect. All right, let's build these. And close that. Gonna take a half an hour to build. That's fine. I don't see any zombies right now. I don't know what's going on with them. Where are you guys at? Might have to try to sleep out here. Turn that on. All right, let's turn the generator on. Uh, yeah, turn on. There we go. And let's see. Oh yeah, it's lit up. I might need some more lights out here. I don't think this is gonna be enough. So I'll probably build a few more. But uh, that's a nice start. I don't know where the zombies are. They uh, they must just not want to come out tonight. Maybe they had a busy day. Maybe they had a bad day. You never know. Let's try to sleep. Oh, yeah. No zombies whatsoever tonight. Well, eventually this will work. But uh, <laughs> once, once we have zombies to kill. Uh, but, uh, yeah, that there you go. We have a nice zombie corral. We've got some lighting. We uh, had a nice little time at the mine. It, it uh, could have been could have been worse. We did get smacked on the butt by the uh, berserker. That was a little bit uh, a little bit weird, but uh, we're okay. And uh, we're gonna turn that off, conserve fuel, and go to bed. So, guys, if you enjoyed the video, give it a like. Let me know what you thought in the comments. Share with your friends. Subscribe to get more videos. And I will see you guys next time. Goodbye.